Since it's a Thursday game, we'll do something different. Um, I have been having a tradition of not doing anything special for the game, like especially if it's a big game. It seems like whenever we do, uh, I always, we always end up losing. So I didn't want to do anything different. Um, I'm actually at work right now, so you know I have to keep this pretty simple. Uh, I'm opening the store. I hope they don't get mad. I mean, I'm still working, but uh, you know, I need to put something out here. So tonight, Oakland Raiders, the battle for number one, possibly. I mean, actually, the biggest game that we've ever had, probably in the series, at least in recent memory, uh, for sure, for the last, mm, I don't know, 20 years, for sure. Um, so offensively tonight, we need to look into making sure we control the clock with the run. Uh, we need to keep the ball out of Derek Carr's hands and uh, make sure we uh, you know, keep it on our side of the field, keep their defense out there because as everybody knows, their defense is suspect. They remind me in that aspect of having a, uh, they don't have a great defense, but they have a really, really good offense. And uh, they remind me in that aspect of like a Dick Vermeil coach team, like the Rams or the Chiefs in the early 2000s. Um, yeah, they were really fire offensively, but defensively they couldn't stop, you know, a couple. They couldn't stop anything. Um, shootouts was always the norm with those teams. And I think that if we can, you know, control the ball much like teams did against those teams that Vermeil had coached, we control the ball and at least be able to stop, which we've seen in the first game that we were able to. Um, so I don't think that's going to be a big problem. But, it, you know, they've been playing. They've won, what, six straight since we beat them. So they're going to be licking their chops, ready to come out there. I just hope our fans, they're going to be ready to uh, do their thing and be cheering. It's going to be cold. It's going to be nasty. They don't, they don't like that type of weather. That doesn't bode well for passing. So, like I said in my last video, Spencer Ware and the fellas uh, better be ready to get some rock, you know, and carry the rock, so to speak, I guess. Uh, sorry, it's early. I don't usually do these early. But, yeah, uh, I'm looking at Alex Smith to make a couple plays to Kelsey and Hill down the field. Uh, you know, just kind of keep things rolling. I wouldn't be surprised if we tried to come out and capitalize off last week, last week's play um, offensively. I would really like to see that. I'd like to see him come out and test that pass defense early. Uh, their biggest weapon on defense is obviously Khalil Mack. He's a beast. A lot like Justin Houston or Von Miller who come off the edge, cause problems. Caused some problems last game. Um, defensively, we just have to have a nice tandem of receivers, Cooper and Crabtree. Cooper, Crabtree, and Carr, Triple C. Uh, yeah, they're, they're pretty good, and they're the real deal. So. Uh, we just have to hold it, hope that Cole gets to him and we can play aggressive like we were, especially against the Broncos, putting hits on people. Uh, look for Eric Berry, Marcus Peters, make a couple big plays. Uh, hopefully Justin Houston can play a few more snaps. I know me and the homie had talked about that too. His snap count was down from the last game. So let's just hope he can play, you know, more snaps and Tomba and D Ford are just as effective and we can put the, pra pa uh, excuse me, the pressure on him. I think it's going to bode well for us. Uh, Carr always has problems with us. He's one and four in his career. Let's uh, let's keep that going. He only beat us his first year, his first game against us. After that, he's on a four-game losing streak. So let's uh, keep it rolling. Let's go out there, get this W tonight, so we can have a have a victory celebration. Uh, in the next video, I don't have to be about an L, and everybody won't feel like they wasted their time coming out and standing in the cold for three hours, four, five, six hours tailgating. Everybody who was out there at noon, one o'clock today, bravo, because I I couldn't do it. You see, I'm cold inside right now. It's cold outside. Um, 
So everybody stay safe, stay warm tonight. As always, like, subscribe. I got work to do. Thanks.